talking about the six different processes of the digestive system. The six steps are ingestion, secretion, motility, digestion, absorption, and defecation. The first step is ingestion. This process involves physically taking in both food and liquids. This is more commonly known as eating. The second process is secretion. Once the food has entered the digestive canal, it requires assistance to begin breaking it down. In order to do this, things such as acids, buffers, and enzymes will be secreted into the lumen, or interior space of the canal, which will coat the food as it passes through. The third process is motility. This refers to the turning and propulsion of food caused by contractions of digestive canal walls, which are made up of smooth muscle. The fourth process is digestion, which is the breakdown of food particles into smaller molecules, both chemically and mechanically. Mechanical digestion takes place along with ingestion and motility as food breaks down physically from chewing and mixing. Chemical digestion causes larger food molecules to be broken down using hydrolysis and are catalyzed by digestive enzymes. The fifth process is absorption, which involves nutrients moving through the digestive canal walls into blood and lymph plasma in order to be circulated throughout the body. The sixth and final step is any indigestible waste or unabsorbed materials left behind after all of the previous processes will exit the digestive canal as feces. Oh, my bad. One, two, three. The, the end! end. <laughs>